Hello everyone, this is from Milwaukee to Nashville. I'm Daniel Goodman. And over there is John Lewandowski. Our show is brought to you by the wonderful folks at Hockey Locker, 202 West Hart Avenue, Milwaukee, Wisconsin. You can call them at 414-800-7585 or visit their website at hockeylockermilwaukee.com. Today was game one of... The uh, Central Division Finals. Yeah, the... Central Division Finals um, versus the Grand Rapids Griffins. At this time, I will turn it over to John. All right. So, shots on goal in the first period. Grand Rapids outshot Milwaukee 6-4. to four. In the second period, Milwaukee outshoots Grand Rapids 12-4. to four. In the third period, Milwaukee outshoots Grand Rapids 11-4. to four. And total Milwaukee outshoots Grand Rapids 27-14. On the power play, Grand Rapids went one for three with two minutes, one infraction, while Milwaukee goes 0 for one with six minutes, three infractions. Scoring in the first period at the 448 mark for Grand Rapids was Carter Mazer scoring his second of the postseason, assisted by Austin Zernak, his second, and Jonathan Berggren, his third. Then at the 15.36 mark, the Admirals get on the board with a goal from Zach LaRue, his sixth of the postseason, assisted by Yusuf Parson, and his sixth, and Ryan Ufko, his, or Ufko, his third. Then in the second, at the 350 mark, Grand Rapids gets on the board again with a goal from Zach Aust Aston Reese, scoring his first of the postseason, assisted by Marco Casper, his first, and Dominic Shine, his third. Then at the 1618 mark, Phil Tomasino scores his fourth of the postseason with an assist from Ozzy Weissblatt, his third, and Fedor Svechkov, his third. Then the third, Marco Casper scores his third with an assist from Brogdon Rafferty, his third, and William Wallander, his first. Then Joel Lesprat scores his first of the postseason with an assist from Marco Casper, his second, and Albert Johansson, his second. That was on the power play slash empty net. Still frustrating. In net for the Admirals was Troy Grosnick stopping 10 of 13, while Sebastian Kosa stops 25 of 27. The Admirals will be back at it on Monday, the 20th. Yeah, five days. You heard that right. Uh, back at Panther Arena, please, please come out and be loud. I know it's Monday. But give us all you got, please. All right, attendance was 3,266. Your referees were Stefan Hip and Mike Sullivan. Linesman were Ryan Jackson and Sean Oliver. All of them completely useless. Um, Before we get through the rest of this, happy birthday to Zach LaRue, uh, your 21st birthday, sir. Uh, three stars of the game. Third star of the game was Sebastian Costa with 25 saves and 27 shots. Second star was Phil Tomasino with a goal. And first star was Marco Casper with two assists and a goal. The Admirals cannot play like this on Monday and expect to continue. Right. Just say. It's, it's pretty simple, pretty straight across. Um, you know, just wanted, you know, kind of yeah. where I'm at. Um, beyond that, um, that is all I got. It is officially 1135. We are exhausted. We will see you all on Monday. I know. That's a long time between now and then. Who knows what we come up with? <laughs> um. Also wanted to say, um, 
not the best night for the guys. Look tired. Look not ready. Um, and Grand Rapids did. All right. Um, that happens. You're gonna get some some nights are like this. Um, not that we got help from the officials at all. There was a lot of uncalled penalties on our end that are on Grand Rapids end that we did. We got called for later in the game, but I was just like. Um, that was like the hooking call on the guys are in the third. I'm like, there were three hooking calls in the first period alone. Yeah. You wait till a minute 30, what, a minute, less than a, two minutes left to call a two minute penalty on the guys. Oh, but you call, you, you, you got guys holding our guys up against the boards. Interfering with his ability to play the game. And no call on that. No call on the hooking from Sebastian Cosa. No call on spearing on Sebastian Cosa. No, no call on potentially removing your helmet for a, a pause in the game from Sebastian Cosa. And that's just on the goalie. If that's going to happen where the goalie's going to come in penalties and you're not going to call it? Unsportsmanlike conduct flipping off fans? No call there. What you going to do? I just want, I just hope to check that the referees got didn't get didn't bounce. <laughs> uh -huh. I'd be bad as shit. But um that's all I gotta say on the officials. They did not do a good job tonight. Um I'll let John lay into this one from his opinion on it. Yeah, I don't think they did very well tonight either. I think there were a lot of missed calls. That's for sure. So, um, now what you do? Uh, try the same percentage of sixty five percent in this game. Yeah, in the playoffs, that is unacceptable. Yeah, it does not matter how bad your defense was. But at the same time, you saw the difference that not having Roland McEwen out there had. Yeah. So, we'll see what happens. We'll see. Five days is a long time. You never know. A couple guys could come back. I know we're banged up a little bit from that series against Texas where Grand Rapids has had rest. Um... I know that they're driving home currently uh, back to Grand Rapids and we'll be back on Sunday. So, um, what's there to say? Uh, currently, Coachella, no, oh, there it is, official. Coachella beats Ontario. Those are your other game tonight. Coachella beat Ontario. Um, but that's all I got for you there. Um, I will see you all on Monday.